Hey guys, how are you doing? Let's do this with this random little team that I got leading off my Rampardos. Get my rocks up and whatever else is good. And he doesn't have a spinner and a ninja, so I'm going to want to get my rocks up. And he wants to get his up for my Yenma, probably, because that's the biggest threat in the world right there. Uh, let's just go super power, get a bunch of damage off on him. And uh, then he'll bring me down to my sash, probably, or just thunder wave me. Either one is fine. And I can just go for it again, and he can go for whatever move. Maybe Drain Punch or whatever. I don't even know. I don't want to go for Head Smash on the off chance that he switches because it probably won't do anything. Or, I mean, it probably won't hit is what I'm trying to say here. And Superpower is not going to kill, but it'll probably come close. Yeah, that's close enough for me. So let's uh, see what he wants to do here. Probably just Earthquake. Again, I could get a free switch to my Yanma, but I'm not doing that. So uh, let's just go for Superpower. If you know what I mean. Alright, and on this guy's team, uh, Swellow might be a threat, but I do have Clang. I don't really see anything walling Clang. And I kind of see this as a great opportunity to set up with him. Because he can Thunder Wave me, and Earthquake probably won't do anything since I'm defensive, and he, uh, yeah, it's not even stabbed, so that won't do anything. And, I mean, he does have this guy, but I don't think that's going to be doing anything to me unless he's, like, specs, which I barely see any of those. And, um, I mean, it could have Roar, possibly, but that's also a very low chance. So, I feel like this is a really good chance to set up with Clang. He does have the one thing to go into early game, or early setup, I'm trying to say. And other than setting uh, him bringing it in like on this turn, I don't think it could do too much because I'm going to be able to outspeed it and I doubt a waterfall. Well, he does get superpower, so there's that. And see that? That's super effective fire punch. That is not doing anything. This is uh, good, <laughs> and he's just going to forfeit. That's no fun. I wanted to see how that played out, but whatever. Um, he didn't even know how I had rest, so what does this guy want to do? You too, good sir, you too. Okay, let's see. Probably going to lead with the Stun Fisk or the Bulldor. I didn't even see that. Why does he have this over the other guy? I don't really know. But, um, yeah, I doubt Superpower will kill, actually. But I can just get my rocks up. Because Braviary is there, and Braviary is a threat. So that'll be that. And, uh, yeah, he does have Sturdy. I could go for the Superpower, but I do want my rocks up pretty badly, actually. And I don't want him to... Yeah, you know what I'm trying to say. And he's just going to go for the Earthquake. So now I can uh, kill him, or try at least. Kill him, or die trying. And I do kill him, so that's really good. And, uh, yeah, thank you, um, Mold Breaker. And uh, I get free rocks and a free kill. Well, actually, not a free kill, but you know what I'm trying to say, don't you? Yes, you do. So I don't know what he wants to do. I'm just going to let myself die. You turn that's fine with me. That just brings your Braviary to 50, and I keep sniffling. I got the sniffles today. Hoof. All right, Samrot's in here. I know Yanma can outspeed and uh, go for something. I'm choice specs, so uh, yeah. That'll be doing some good damage. And I don't know, I guess I'm lagging here. Because I clicked that and it's not going. Maybe I'm lagging, he, he's lagging, the server's lagging. I don't even know. But they keep changing smog on so much. And I don't really want to lock myself into Giga Drain. I think I'll lock myself into Bug Buzz because uh, that's Stab. And um, yeah, <laughs> Waterfall straight takes me out while he was at Blaze. But um... Yeah, effective Rampardos, yep. I'm not going to say that much, but yeah, it did work pretty well, actually. I can go into Jinx now and get up a sub or just Psychic or whatever. You know what I'm saying? I can just, uh, Psychic. He wants to go into that stupid, uh, Mushy, then I don't really care. He wants to go into, like, he doesn't really have anything else to go into besides, like, Stunfisk, and I could probably get a free sub on that. And if it does go into Masharna, I can sub and scout for the uh, mono-attacking set or whatever. 
So that's cool. He's probably going to bring in Braviary or, yeah, no, he actually does bring in Masharna. So that shows me that he probably is, um, the set that I'm, uh, that I was thinking of with, a Signal Beam. So let's see what he wants to do with that. I'm going to go ahead and set up a Nasty Plot on the chance that he's probably going to set up a Calm Mind. Or he just wants a Signal Beam. So that's going to do a lot, but I'm actually just going to go for the Ice Beam. Wanting to take out this uh, thing. And he does have... I mean, the only thing I could do something against is, like, Stun Fisk. And, yeah, you know what I'm trying to say. No, you don't. Let's go to Tauros. And go for that strong double edge. If he wants to switch, that's fine with me. I don't really care. I just want to get off a big double edge on something. And in that case, it's going to be the Masharna. And he probably is going to bring in his Girder. Yeah, that's pretty much this. Uh, Girder has been a problem for this team in the last, like, four battles I've had. So, um, let's see. I can go into Mandibuzz. Hopefully taunt, um... To stop him from setting up. Hopefully he doesn't have sub like the couple that I actually have seen. Never saw sub punching Girder that much, but I have seen it recently. That's not gonna do all too much. I'm actually gonna toxic before I taunt because I really do want him poisoned actually. And yeah, he's just gonna go for the ice punch anyways. He might predict me to roost and I don't know about that. I'm uh, Drain Punch did 27, so super effective. That'll do 54, and I can still live. So that's going to be the plan anyways. And actually, wait, what? Did I, like, miscalc that or something? I thought I did two times. Oh, no, he has Guts. That's right. Dang. That's, uh, that's not good. Oh, this is not good. <laughs> this is really not good. I have a fighting weakness except for Yanma. Oof. Oh my gosh, okay. I have to make a decision here. I can go into Tauros and intimidate him. And Clang is gonna be is not gonna be doing too much because of uh this guy, but I kinda need it for Braviary. So uh let's see, I can go into Tauros then Clang. I guess that can be a plan because that just kinda lowers his attack. And Clang will probably take this uh, Drain Punch pretty well, or he's just going to switch, so uh, that's cool. I don't know what he was predicting there. Maybe he's, like, physical, or he wanted to get the static. I'm not completely sure, but I'm just going to shift gear, see how much this Earth Power is going to do. Or the Scald. This, if he doesn't have Earth Power, then I might be able to win this, um, because I do have Rest, and <laughs> poof, this will be good. I don't have any attack investment, though, so it'll be hard to take out the Girder. And he probably will be able to beat me on a 1v1. And you probably should switch into that right now. Because I'm only going to be at like 350 attack or somewhere around there. And if he discharge paralyzes me, I don't care all too much. I'm just going to go for a gear grind right now. See how much it's going to do. Um, I'm actually not sure at all. Depending on if he's defensive or physical. And I kind of don't want to get um, hexed before something comes in and that is doing absolutely nothing so i'm gonna have to set up a lot and speaking of which i did get paralyzed i am just gonna go for the rest now show him i have it i guess or i don't really know i feel like the braviary or the girder could take me out in one hit so i don't really want to risk not or er, being status is what i'm saying even though now i do show him that i do have rest i can go for the sleep talk now and if he wants to switch i can possibly get the gear grind which i do get and uh, looking by this damage, it is going to take a very long time to um, <laughs> take out this freaking Stunfisk. I'm just going to try to set up to plus 6 or at least a lot higher the, of attack that is because, yeah, and he's probably just hoping for the crit at this time. And I'm just going to start um, freaking gear grinding away because may as well start now and one of us is eventually going to get a crit that's probably going to change this. And... <laughs> Uh, yeah, so uh, I didn't even come up with this set. This is straight off Smogon, so yeah, don't uh, give me credit. But uh, <laughs> I would say thanks if it was my set, but it is not. And he's going to go into Girder now, probably predicting the rest. That's a good play. I am scared to see how much this uh, Drain Punch is going to do, actually. I hope I get the gear grind right here. Let's see. Um, and I get the shift gear, so let's see. Maybe next time I'll get it. And this is a two-hit kill. Oh, my gosh. That is crazy. So hopefully I'll get it this time. If not, then that's good game. And he is going to go for the Mach punch, punch, which kills me. 
Dang, son. So now I have to hope that his freaking Braviary isn't scarfed. <laughs> and hopefully this will kill him. Let's see. Double-edged banded. I don't think it'll kill, honestly. Probably won't. And he might he probably switch anyways, which would probably be a good play. Probably switch into Stunfisk as fodder. Um, yeah, because I can't. He could save this. Hopefully I'll get enough damage for him to take me out with Mach Punch and no static. Aw, oh, dang it. I, I said it, and that's what got me to get it. Oh, well, good game. <laughs> Lost again, man. And he's... No, don't do this. Oh, he's Sleep Talk Rest Discharge Skull. That's cool. Um, I ran a set like that on Stunfisk back, back, back in the day, and I don't think it worked very well. And I'm probably going to take me out if he doesn't take me out on this turn. So, yeah, that kind of sucks. And uh, this wasn't working for me earlier, uh, the whole Smogon deal. So, not Smogon. I don't know what WP means. Um, um, the whole showdown wasn't working for me for like an hour earlier. I don't know. But, yeah. So, uh, you can leave a like if you enjoyed that. Uh, leave me suggestions for Pokemon because I'll put them on a team just like this. I'm going to base a team around this Clang so you can suggest Pokemon for that. I don't really know. Um, other than that, I'll see you later. Have a good one.